Hi everyone. I've been sitting around the house doing a bunch of housework and cleaning and stuff and I wanted to come in and spend some time with the babies. So I thought I'd just do a video while I'm here. Uh, had to change mom's whelp bed out again. She's still making some messy and uh I just wanted to clean it up before we try to handle the babies. Check these gorgeous little piglets out. <laughs> this is our little boy, Jax, a Red Vaughn boy. Come here, baby. Let's look at you. He's got that white inside his back legs that I think is so pretty. It shows good from the back side and from the front when you're looking in. <laughs> it just looks so pretty. Isn't he a pretty boy? He's going to probably be the same color as Sheba. Yeah. Hey, Mom, let's don't. You bump him right out of my hand if you're trying to. I'll give him to you. How's that? Now you can clean him. Look at that white foot on the back. Both of the back feet are white. <laughs> you got that white comes up the hips on both sides. That's pretty unique. I like that. And then we have Benny, our little black mast fawn, on one side. <laughs> oh, he's a big boy. He's a big boy. Oh, he's so pretty. Look how pretty you are, gorgeous little boy. Oh, he's got some white on his ear. You're gorgeous, baby. Yes, you are. Oh, so pretty. So, so pretty. Let's look at you. Oh, let's look at you. Oh, got your tongue out. Blowing his kisses. He's got the darker back feet. White toes, though. That'll be nice when it's time to clip nails. Oh, you're a gorgeous boy. Yes, you are. So that is Jax, the red fawn, and Benny, the black masked fawn. And then we have Jordan and Jacob. I think Jordan is the slightly smaller black mast fawn. Beautiful, full black mast collar and white legs. Mom, can't you clean a different baby? You got to clean the one that I'm wanting. He's so beautiful. Yes, he is going to wiggle right out of my hand. <laughs> and then Jacob is the, I believe, um, I don't have my cheat sheet with me. Jacob and Jordan are the two full black masks. And one of them is larger than the other one. I think this is Jacob. He's the one that's already weighing just over a pound. But... Jordan's not far behind him. Mom, but he is gorgeous. He's going to have a nice, nice head. Come around here, baby. Beautiful coloring. I just love that dark fawn coloring. And black mask. Uh, a little brown in his collar, but he's got a full collar and white front legs and white feet. A little white going up the hips on the inside, like a, was it Jack's the red bone? And he's just beautiful. He's just gorgeous. He's a big boy. Those are the four that are available. Oh, Mama, you better clean. We don't need to see that. And then this is our little girl, Shaylee. And she's already taken. 
She's a gorgeous little black bass fawn. That white is just looks so good, gonna stand out so pretty. Like Sheba's, I just love Sheba's white. She has a big collar down her shoulders, and uh, so does Jack's and Benny. Shaylee, she's going to have just probably right to the top of her shoulders. Let's see you, baby girl. The four boys are all available. And they were born February 23rd. They'll be ready to go. I think it was April the 19th. And um, they're AKC registered, and mom and dad have been cleared on JHC and DM and uh, the four uh, hereditary panel on genetics. They're clear. They're not carriers. No. So we're located in Lowell, Arkansas. So if you're looking for a black mass fawn, boy, somebody message me. Me and Mama Sheba, we're just taking applications, <laughs> looking to find the right home for these babies. Somewhere where they'll be loved and appreciated, <laughs> spoiled, because they're getting spoiled right now, boy. Mama's such a good mama. <laughs> Look, are you stuck under there? Yeah, she's laying on him. Oh, get off of him, mama. <laughs> yeah. They eat and they sleep and they eat and they sleep. <laughs> but it won't be long and they're going to be uh, very getting active and, and putting on a fun time for us to be able to watch as soon as those eyes start opening. They'll be a week old tomorrow. I think eyes should open around 12 days old. So, next week sometime we'll see the eyes pop open and then the personalities will start popping out and, and then it won't be long and they'll be moving to the Big playpen in the living room where they have lots of room to run and play. They'll be uh, get started on litter box training. And they'll be socialized around all my other dogs and uh, noises and people and everything. So, so just keep following us because we're going to have lots of puppy shenanigans to, to entertain everybody. Anyway. <laughs>